Governor's School is amazing. This is a public uh, residential high school. So 11th and 12th graders live here. They get to try out all the different kinds of art that there is. It's kind of like a small BFA or even a small MFA program, but for these highly talented students who live in South Carolina. They have a regular high school experience uh, in the morning, and then in the afternoon, they're in an arts program. And we do teach them how to draw in proportion, how to design with typography, how to photograph, how to weld. We, we teach them these kinds of skills, but then we do also teach them about life because they live here uh, and we get to know them so well. They understand the world through the eyes of an artist and, and we help guide them. Having a partnership like this with Wacom has provided uh, the tools that students are expected to know uh, in the workplace. I've been using Wacom products for uh, probably 25 years now. I've used them in previous institutions, but here at the Governor's School, uh, we've been using them almost exclusively for digital sculpting, 2D animation, stop motion animations, touch up of video, and we use the Wacom product across the board. Having the Cintiq displays is really incredible to see how much of a difference it has made with their the quality of work, their ease of use, that just kind of intuitive way of just working directly on that display. See, I get excited about it. It helps them get excited about it, right? It's this really awesome thing to experience in real time as they're learning. When you're really combining the traditional mediums and the digital mediums, open things up uh, so students can explore concepts where they're taking, you know, dirt they found outside and turning that into something digital and then reprinting that and recombining it in a, in a lot of different ways. So it's that synergy back and forth between traditional and digital that really allows a student to have a possibility space for creation that's much broader. The movement to the Cintiq Pro has been absolutely amazing. So first off, I love the texture of the screen. It's not too tactile, so it doesn't drag on your pen, but at the same time, it's not like I'm drawing on glass. You know, it has the right traction. It's a lot more intuitive, and it helps uh, with the workflow a lot more. When it comes to sculpting, being able to work directly on that tablet helps it feel like I'm still working with clay and being able to move it with my hands instead of feeling so detached from it as I would without the screen. And when it comes to some of the 2D things that I work on, which is usually gonna be texturing for the projects that I have, it really feels like I'm just working with a paintbrush or working with a pencil. The upgrade from the Intuos to the Cintiq really does allow the students to have a WYSIWYG workflow. What you see is what you get. So they're able to put the, the digital pen to paper exactly like they would in the real world. The Wacom products feel tactically similar to pen and paper. So when we go from traditional animation on pen and paper to the digital, it bridges that gap beautifully. So they can iterate faster and then also be able to get results that not only feel good to them, but, but work well for their audience. Because of tools like the Cintiq, our, our students are able to bring a lot of their tradition through this apprenticeship program, but then bring it forward. So we see a lot of the textures that they're learning about in their painting classes and, and using charcoal on paper, but we're able to utilize that in a way that just feels natural for an artist who maybe doesn't feel comfortable with technology normally. They don't feel that discomfort anymore. I think this is really an investment in people who are hungry to create. And so no matter what their age is, they want to be here making cool stuff and the Cintiqs are just a good way to facilitate that. I think the partnership with Wacom and being able to have this technology, this I mean, top of the line, state of the art, Cintiq equipment that they can use, for me, I see that as very much a game changer. If I had that when I was a high schooler, it, it would have been mind blowing, right, to me, really. I say, the fact that you have this technology, the fact that you have these like incredible Cintiq tablets, this kind of hardware to like create the, the things you're creating, this is next level stuff. 2D, 3D, animation, modeling, uh, illustration, all types of things, anything digital, I'm going to be using the Cintiq Pro. It's been a great experience. Um, I would hope to be able to get into indie game development with the knowledge that I get in computer science and the animation expertise that I have gained over my two years here. I also just want to continue doing art. If I didn't have some sort of creative outlet, I think I'd go insane. <laughs> Having Wacom technology in the classroom does give our students a leg up. Uh, they're, they're learning the most cutting-edge technology and they're able to have their, their visions realized. <laughs>